From our New Mexico Mobile Newsroom now, Las Cruces City officials giving residents a chance to return those shopping carts that have been taken from businesses. Good morning, El Paso's Isabella Martinez joins us live from Las Cruces with those details. Good morning. Good morning, Hillary. This is the first shopping cart take back day where individuals will be able to return those shopping carts without facing any penalties. Now, if needed, officers from the Las Cruces Police Department here will provide and offer wagons and backpacks for personal belongings in exchange. Now, this ordinance addresses the crime of stolen property as shopping carts technically belong to businesses. However, Lieutenant Joy Huitala with the Las Cruces Police Department explained that the ordinance ordinance also aims to offer support to individuals facing homelessness, addiction, or mental health challenges. Rather than focusing solely on punishment, the goal is to provide resources and support to those in need. Every individual that's potentially going to be in possession of these cards is going to have some type of story, some type of backstory. And with that said, um, especially as officers, we want to take a look at what that story is and how we're addressing it the best that we can. Now, today's take back day will be held at the parking lot of the 2200 block of Loman Avenue and at the Mesilla Valley Community of Hope, both from 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. The Las Cruces Police Department will hold another take back day on October 15th, the day before the official enforcement begins of this new ordinance. ordinance. And of course, you can head over to KVI.com for all the details. For now, I'm reporting live from Las Cruces, Isabela Martinez, ABC7.